that's the map. Here's the map. Where do you wish to go? Golly! Gee willikers! I can't wait to dong some babondos! Someone made a video of Morshu singing Somebody That I Used To Know by Gautier. And it was, obviously, you can only use the sentences that the Morshu actor said as Morshu. And yet, it, it weirdly worked very well. I mean, I know people have been doing this for years now for the poop sentence mixing. I'm just amazed that they're still finding new and innovative ways to do it and to shit posts by, for example, posting um, Morshu singing Gautier, somebody that I used to know song from the time that it was made. Amen. Is this the song right here? I'd like to play a little bit of it. It won't get claimed. I want to hear the, the chorus. I Okay, I've had enough. It's 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 good, but Jesus, do Link's part? Wait, wait, Link sings in that too? Vinny, you you cut him off. I didn't have to cut him off, but I did anyway. Now then, then I think of all the times you screwed me over. This is so fucking dumb. Don't have to be leaving. It was so weak something that I was done. Because I'm the one of you that we are going into every word you see. You said that you could let it go. And I want to catch you on the bombs and rubies that I used to go. <laughs> oh my god. I just wonder, like... God, what if you told these actors what was going to happen to their voices? That was fascinating. Um, yeah, I, I just wonder, like, do you think... In the grand scheme of the universe... That, like, if you could go back in time and tell those actors, like, listen, you, you're gonna be a part of a thing that's way bigger than any one of you. You will do 25 minutes of work that will last for decades. They'd be like, for this project? And you'd say yes. Mark Grau returned from Hotel Mario to voice one. That's true. He did. Yes, Mario's voice actor has embraced the meme. Somebody that I used to. You know, there's a lot of things that people thought would just be a paycheck and ended up becoming big. Yeah, any of the room. Troll 2. Not that they were really able to really monetize the uh, Troll 2 that, like they did the room. Because Tommy, whatever you say about him, is probably true. But he's also a very good businessman. I'm just saying, he knew how to monetize that room selling underwear the, the day after it became a meme. He's like, oh, you wear my underwear on your balls. <laughs> This movie is black comedy. It's supposed to be funny, but let you laugh, you cry. Tommy did it to an obnoxious degree. I actually agree with that. I think Tommy's acceptance of his meme status in many ways became... It diminished some of the fun of the room because it just became too self-aware. And then he made a bunch of, like, awful projects that were attempts at comedy. And then, like, he did, like you know, 50 showings of the room a year, anywhere they would have him at a midnight screening. And you know what? I've been to one of them, it was fucking awesome. But, like, that dude has to really think about... He has to know people are laughing at the movie. But, you know what? While they're laughing at the movie, Tommy's laughing all the way to the fucking bank. <laughs> 